Hey there guys, so uh, we had uh, some uh, bad weather lately but uh, luckily tonight it uh, seems like there is going to be a clear night uh, the only issue that I'm having right now is that uh, all of my gear is uh, very dirty and uh, dusty so uh, I need to clean it first which is uh, something that I don't really like to do but, uh, but yeah, I guess it's probably best if I if I grab uh, all of my cleaning gear and just, uh, yeah, let's just get it over with. Okay, so we are well within the galaxy season right now and uh, I have to say that that's uh, not the most exciting time for me and uh, not because I don't like to image uh, galaxies, it's just uh, that with my current setup the field of view is just too wide uh, to get close and uh, fill up the frame with uh, a beautiful galaxy. So I hope that I will pull up, uh, up uh, some of the neighboring galaxies. Uh, surrounding the M106 galaxy which I'm going to image uh, tonight but yeah galaxies are definitely one of those deep sky objects uh, which you can image without uh, a modified uh, camera but again most galaxies are quite small in the night sky so that's why I've been thinking about uh, an upgrade uh, quite a lot lately and uh, some of you may already know this that uh, I'm actually asking you quite a lot of questions uh, about the gear you are using and the experiences that uh, you got with it but yeah so before i forget uh, let me just mention that uh, i'll probably uh, put uh, a stacked image in the description of the video so if any of you is interested uh, to process the images uh, which are going to take tonight you can just uh, download it from the google drive so if any of you is going to process the image and uh, post it on instagram uh, i would just like to ask you if uh, if you could tag me so i can take a look at uh, what you came up with <laughs> Okay, so I just finished processing the image and after 4 hours of doing just that, uh, all that I have to say is that uh, it's definitely not uh, one of my favorite images that I took and as I mentioned earlier, the setup that I'm using uh, right now is uh, really not that well suited for galaxies, except of course for the Andromeda and the Triangle because all the other galaxies are way smaller and even that I did manage uh, to pull out uh, some of the smaller surrounding galaxies. I'm still uh, quite bummed uh, about the image. I did took a few example exposures of the Pinwheel Galaxy and uh, that looks uh, quite a bit more promising. So that will probably be so that will probably be blah, blah, blah. so that will probably be my uh, my next target. But anyway, so I'll still share the image with you guys uh, even though I'm not uh, really proud of it. And don't forget that there's a link in the description of the video. To the stacked uh, image so yeah if any of you wants to go ahead and process it i really hope that for next year i'll be more prepared uh, for galaxy season because even though that the nebulas are quite uh, beautiful deep sky objects uh, i really like galaxies but again i can uh, do much with uh, the setup i'm uh, having right now and yeah i would just like to mention that the coming sunday uh, i will continue with my processing series so this sunday i will go over stacking which i know i should have done uh, earlier but uh, I also have a background calibration and a noise reduction uh, video planned uh, how to achieve the 3D look 
and uh, and how I do my Star Trails time lapses. And I think that I'll also go over masks. But if uh, any of you have uh, any suggestions or amazing topics that uh, you would like me to go over, then please mention them in the comments. But uh, but yeah, I think that that's about it for this video. And uh, yeah, I would like to thank you for watching and see you guys next time. Take care. Bye.